What's going on, everybody? My name is Brendan McNeil, and this is the Genre Challenge. <sighs> Welcome to the game show of sorts, where you pick the genre of music, and I make it. Every week on my Instagram, I ask you to make a post, where then you place a genre of music in the comments, and the top five with the most likes gets picked to uh, enter the contest. Simple as that. And right now, I'm having wonderful bass brought to you by some beautiful lightning and thunder. It literally looks like the death outside. As Florida does. I mean, I, I always forget how thunderstorms are every time the summer comes around, but they're quite frightening with the white lightning. Anywho, well, with all that said, let's get into the top five of this week. So kicking this right off at the number one, we have G-Funk, which is basically known as Gangster Funk. Gangsta Funk. However you want to pronounce it, whatever way you want to say it. That's number one, brought to you by Tommy Shriner, once again, who's made it for, I think this is the third time, so welcome back. He keeps bringing genres of music that everyone likes and wants to see me do, so that's what's up. Number two, we have something that is actually not even a genre of music, but a person, so I guess I would replicate their style of music, and that is none other than the infamous Mark, I never know how to say his last name, but Ribblet. Rebel? I'm sure you could correct me. This is the internet, and that's what you are known for, you as a personified entity. <laughs> anyway, that was brought to you by the Wolf of All Streets, otherwise known as Evan. Number three coming in, we have R&B, brought to you by Oh My Goodness Goddess, which is also my beautiful wife, who... Honestly, if you like to look at things that are inspiring and about health and wellness, go check that woman out. I got to plug her since she made it in this week. I don't have to. I want to. Go ahead and do it. And number four, we have Country Rock, brought to you by Mike M5662. Yeehaw, baby. And coming in at number five, we have Celtic Jazz. And they also left a comment down below that says, this is going to be a challenge, I think. Something along the lines of that. What did it say? Yeah, maybe uh, with all this lightning and thunder, it's one of the Celtic gods, and they're gonna kind of, kind of, gonna kind of, kind of come a ch ch chameleon, <laughs> gonna come and help me out, because I could use some help, because I don't know Celtic jazz, but you know what? I will do it for this. Well, without further ado, and delaying you on your sweet Saturday, let's pull up the wheel to the side. All right, here it is. We are clicking to spin. And the first one out is Celtic Jazz. All right. Well, I guess we won't be v going down that adventure this week. But thank you, Jomo Wilson, for entering. Number four going out is or number two, Country Rock. R&B. All right. So we are now left with G-Funk and Mark Rebellet. Rebellet. That is such a terror. Well, he's he's gone. So I, I'll i find out how to say his name another time. So you know what, guys? Once again, I think this is the third time out of 11 songs that we are finally making. We are entering the rap realm. You know what? I'm down. Make some funk music. Rap over it like a wankster. I mean, uh, I'm pretty sure 50 Cent would approve of me being called a wankster. But anyway, if you haven't already, please hit subscribe down below and hit the like button and while you're at it maybe get at that little bell for the notifications over here or over here or watch this little quick video but regardless thank you so much for tuning in every week and if you like it go ahead and share it among your friends but without further ado let this honky get you right on down to some g funk take it away future me I had a 
a steady bed to sleep on Head was always shaking if I had my little dreams on Night terrors plaguing my every waking moment All the screaming at night with the demons always howling Everything out of proportional thoughts that I saw But I forgot once I woke where I ought to be Me looking so confusing Was it just a dream or was my inner self slowly drifting? Loosely lip liars laughing, dreaming, dreaded thoughts in my lion Are all these creatures existing in my bed? Scaly screaming eyes, they begin to scratch upon my chest I can no longer scream as my voice is wound up dead Grabbing at my ankles, I am anchored in the reach Ripped in my lifeless body, no longer glued to the sheets Why is nobody coming? Can they feel the thunder of the feet? As the fist not crashing my head, muted screams Are you dead now? Are you dead now? Lifting my head up, my body slowly awakens. Crest crisp eyelids are gazing upon the ceiling. Why am I not left in my bed now that I am feeling a gut disassociated of fear slowly reeking? I may have been walking in my sleep from how it seems, but the scratches on my chest just still freshly bleed. The presence in the air is thick with gut wrenching steam, and I am in my closet lying on dirty closed seams, walking to my bed throughout the damp and dark. Getting back in bed, my eyes dart to the far open closet from where my soul felt that it was drowned. My head comes down and my body dreads unsound round red eyes relishly looking at me with large white teeth devilishly cackling. Mother always told me that this was just a dream, but I feel that there is more than it seems. Are you dead?